Hello, and hey there, everybody. What's going on, and how are you doing out there? And hey to the chat here on Twitch. Hope is everyone, hope everyone is all right and well. Join your day on this Friday. And this is Dirty Gamer, and I'm here uh, for the Fortnite new live item shop update for today, March 24th, 2023, 32423. Take time to shout out thanks to all my subscribers and followers. And if you are new to my channel or a new viewer, welcome to my layer. Showing your support by viewing my videos. Liking up, thumbs up my videos, sharing my videos takes just a button click. All would help my content to be seen. Have those bell notifications turned on. All is appreciated. I have been uploading videos consistently. For those new to my channel, new viewers, subscribe on YouTube and follow me on Twitch. Both are free. And I appreciate you all for doing that. All right, so let's get on over to the shop here. Uh, quick, my click back and forth. Uh, I'm not, I, I, due to these past few item shops, I'm not really, I don't know if it's going to be much better, but hey, let's see what we got. So it looks like in Space Returns, um, with the Riley and Xenomorph bundle, uh, I do think this is actually a very decent bundle. Um, it's going to be for 2200 V-Bucks. Now let me take a look to see when this was last in. Okay, January 18th, 2023, so 66 days ago. It's still within that time frame I've been noticing between 20 plus to 60 plus days, but this is an okay bundle uh, that I do recommend though, uh, especially because there's value here for that 2200. So let me just show you what it includes. Uh, it is going to be for six items. So we have the Xenomorph, which to me is the main, uh, the main get from this bundle. You can see right here, the infamous alien. Again, and you could see if you zoom up, you could see the little, once in a while you will get like some uh, drool coming out of the mouth. So a little animated there, if you focus, there it is, just came out there. And then the Xenomorph tail backling, which I guess makes sense. You would think it would have already been part of the outfit, but um, it does match. And then we have the Ellen Ripley outfit. Um, kind of reminds me a little of like the back to the future look in a way but it does make sense because the 80s type of retro look almost looks like you see the shoes there white and red so this is the bait the default and then this is the nostromo clue crew look i'm a little more familiar with from the movies there the alien movies and then the wayland yutuni cat carrier so there you go the little cat that will pop up every once in a while now, it doesn't say that it's animated or reactive, but uh, you can see there's a little bit there. Then the Xeno Slurp loading screen with the alien there. And then the Xeno Menace built-in emote. Which I think is really a heck of a cool uh, emote, so I would recommend, you know... And it does come with if you want to get it separately. Uh, but again, it doesn't make sense to if if you are interested in the bundle because it's twenty two hundred. Um, this character is sixteen hundred for that X is six hundred. There is value just to get the bundle. Um, the Ellen Ripley outfit is fifteen hundred. Now there is also this separate. They do have a separate space gear bundle. Which you can see is for 1500 it includes this burst case scenario cheyenne dropship glider and a power loading arm tool and it's 800 v bucks off so i'll just show you here's the burst case scenario emote so it's going to come out like that interesting reference there obviously the llama instead of an alien and then the p5000 power loader arm has a decent sound but it's a little bit too basic for my liking and then the Cheyenne dropship again I think there might have been better value if this was maybe priced closer to like maybe 1200 or a thousand but so be it onto the feature tab they brought back the rats attack bundle which I do recommend and own and I think this was relatively recent that they just rotated this around yeah, February 21st, which was just a mere 32 days ago. Um, 
So let me just show you, show you what's in it. It's going to include uh, six items, including the built-in emote. So here's the Camille uh, style. Obviously, you can see with those ears, reminiscent of a rat. And default style. And then here's the battle tail, what, which is a style that is transformed or you can turn into. And then the heart's attack backling. It is reactive. Um, doesn't say how or why. Oh, actually it does. The heart's attack backling will pulse with eliminations. One of the loading screen. And then use the squeak amount to transform, which I'll show. And you have the rat tail tool. It's okay. It's a little zappy sounding. Then you also get a wrap, a Rattus Rappus, which is okay. It's unfortunate it's not animated or reactive, however. Then the Street Rats loading screen, a bit basic, but it does show like both of those options. And then here's the squeak built-in emote. You can see just very quick, jumps up, transforms into the rat, and then just to show, sneezes out of it. So it's kind of a funny little uh, emo how that works. Oh, and they brought back the Sika or Sika bundle. This is actually a decent bundle. I do like it. It's for uh, 2100 V-Bucks. However, let me take a look to see when it was last in the shop. Yeah, February 19th. So just 34 days ago. Again, kind of a, another rotational recycled item. But it is a decent one at least. Uh, especially with that glider. So let me show you. So the bundle itself is 2100. Um, and there is value because the outfit itself is 1200. The tools a and this uh, glider, which is really cool, is 1500. Um, that was my one of my major incentives was the glider. Uh, but let me just show you here. So here's the Sika outfit. You get the default option, kind of like a warrior champion look. I really do like this default masked look. However, the no mask is not bad either. But obviously the same outfit. And you can also make out the cuts there and the definition of the warrior as well. Really cool kind of loincloth and emblem. Again, really decent detail with the gold and leather kind of aesthetics there. Then the Arena Elite Backling. This is okay because at least the eyes, you do get a little bit of animation with that purple, uh, as you can see, coming out. So it's pretty cool. And then the Arena's Blessing Tool also has that nice purple hue. And you see, hue, and you see uh, the two like kind of like lions or tigers there on the side of it. And it's actually a decent sound. And you see the contact makes that purple trail. And then finally, what I think is the coup de grace the set is this Cerebrus or Cerebrus Glider. I'm going to redeploy just to kind of show you what I pay attention to when it kind of deploys. See, they're running in. They get chained right away. And then also the paw prints, the purple paw prints that come from the bottom. I think that's really kind of cool too. So, so like I said, very decent value. All right, and now we're on to the next page, the Chaos Agent outfit, which I'm pretty confident has been recently also rotated and recycled. Yep, February 17th, 2023, so just 36 days ago. And I'm going to think that's going to be the same with the Scythe. And I think that ooze was just yesterday. Yeah, oh my gosh. So this was just yesterday, by the way, which is pretty interesting. Um, so here's the Chaos Agent for 1500. You do get the stock two, you get the default style here, and then the Goopy, as you could see. It kind of rem reminds me of a Hitman assassin suit suited look. Then the Ooze Chamber back bling. Not much really here, just a little ooze that comes out for it. Then the the Chaos or Chow Sky Tool for 800. It's a little tinny sounding. The thing is, I actually like the look of the tool. I just hate how weak it sounds on the contact. And again, the Black Ooze, which was just here yesterday, is already back. But I do recommend it for 500 However, which doesn't make sense to me is these should have been bundled. I don't know why they didn't do that, because but it would have been much more incentive. All right, now we're on to the Doggo outfit and the items. And I know this has been rotated. Yep, February 16th, 2023, just 37 days ago. And that goes to the doggy bag and the chew toy and the rough. By the way, all of these should be bundled, and they're not. So here's the doggo outfit here, default style. Again, I've seen this a lot in the store. Festive and militia. Again, some of these things are just keep re repeating and re-rotating, getting a bit tired, beyond tired. The Odin chow down backling. The doggy bag backling for 200 there you go. Nothing much there. The Chew Toy Tool. 
It's a gold plastic bone, it looks like. It has a little bit of a thuddy crunch sound, though, so it sounds more like a bone than I thought it would. Then the rough wrap for 300, you can see it's pretty basic. It does have, uh, you know, multiple tones on it, but not animated nor reactive, so a little bit less incentive. All right, now we're on to the daily tab with the Spartan Assassin outfit. This is, looks to me like another kind of just base type of daily tab outfit. Matter of fact, was in the store just on February 20th, 2023, so just a week, near 33 days ago. So here you go with the Spartan Assassin look. Again, just a base character and a mask and like the typical kind of like commando militia outfit with the digitized camo. Then the blockade runner. Let's take a look at this one. This was February 1st. Oh, wow. 2022. So we're talking 417 days. So this was at least a little bit longer. But for 1200, I don't know. It just looks a little plain and basic to me. Yeah, there's orange and black, but I don't know. I guess the hairstyle is a bit different. And then the angled intercept backlink, which to me is pretty basic, but it does match the outfit. I think they could have came up with something better than that to unvault from 417 days ago, my humble opinion. All right, so now we actually do have the music track and emotes. So what I'll do is I'll take a quick pause here and I'll allow to play, uh, play that out here. So let me just take a quick look to see when was this, this Butter Barn Hoedown. January 31st, 2022. So this is 418 days ago. So let's take a listen. It definitely gives me the country vibes, that's for sure. Huh. People actually do like this, though, this track. The lyrics are kind of interesting. I just don't know if it has a place for my particular um, audio selection for this. But And then we're on to the Lama Cadabra for 800, which was just in the shop on February 7th, which was just 46 days ago. Oh, there you go. So I don't know. For eight hundred, I think it's a little overpriced. And then the chess master for three hundred, February seventh, also forty-six days ago. So it's a sync demote. So you kind of get an idea of what you'll be doing is playing big chess here with someone else and yeah that's going to be it obviously since it's synced you won't see the other one until there's another person they really should find a way for these synced emotes to be able to have like maybe a fake or visual stand-in figure so you can see what the synced emote actually does it makes a lot of sense to me but i don't know why it doesn't make sense to anyone there at epic games of the team all right then we have the breezy emote which is uh in the shop january 29th 2023 just 50 uh what was that five 55 days ago so this is 200 and part of the hot air set so obviously that kind of like uh like the balloon that you see kind of in front of certain like uh places or car or like car dealerships things of that nature so that's kind of what it's making fun of and it looks like we've reached the repeat portion already of the shop wow so cypher pk bundles still here in their items the Immortal Sands bundle, also still here. Raccoon City Survivors, obviously still here uh, because of the Resident Evil 4 remake. I'm not sure if it's going to hold through the weekend or not. Uh, special offers and bundles, Battle Pass, Fortnite Crew, Sub and Crew Legacy Set. Wow. So this is a shop to me that was really truncated. There's like a lot less stuff than I think should usually be in it. And obviously, some of the stuff is repeats. A lot of the stuff is your typical recycled, re-rotation uh, things. And they do have a couple of bundles that I do recommend that I do own, however. But there's a lot less. This, this shop is probably one of the lightest and weakest in terms of volume of content. But, like I mentioned earlier, there is a couple of bundles that I do recommend and own. So let's just go through those real quickly here.
Um, so I would recommend, again, I can mention for Raccoon City Survivors, if it'll hold through the weekend or not, I'm not sure, but there is value in that bundle. The Cypher PK's Locker bundle. Um, that music, I'm not too sure. It's not my taste, but I can see people liking it. The Black Ooze Wrap. The Sika or Sika bundle, especially that glider, really just kind of put it for incentive. The Rats Attack bundle. And the In Space Ripley and Xenomorph bundle. So, yeah. That's it. So, that's actually going to do it. Uh, this has been Dirty Gaming here for the uh, Fortnite new live item shop update for today, March 24th, 2023. 3 24 23 so just let me know if you're interested what you think you're intending on purchasing anything from the shop update and uh did you or somebody know like a birthday shout out comments or questions you can answer any and all by dropping a comment on the video uh liking up the video commenting subscribing and sharing my videos all would help my content to be seen from my youtube channel dirty with two r's gamer have those bell notifications turned on I also live stream on Twitch, take comments, questions, give birthdays and shout outs, which I'm doing here. And please follow me also free. Enjoy my live streams and chatting gaming sessions at the username dirty with two R's underscore gamer. All is appreciated. For super thanks, would appreciate donations via my link. All right, that's going to do it. Later to all and to the chat here on Twitch. Get your game on and your game dirt. Please don't forget to like comment, follow, and subscribe. All is appreciated.